So here at Best Fence, I make a very large, complicated product that has a lot of variables. Our main variables come from our fences. So there's two types. We've got one with a back lip and one that is flat. And then we've also got two different kinds of tape. This one, for instance, is Imperial. So if I'm building Imperial, when I go through the order at the beginning, I'm going to hit this button that shows me that's the type of tape that I need to use. If I'm doing metric, it's gonna be this one. And it's color coded to make it easier. The other variable with the back lip or flat, I'm gonna come over here because these, for the one with the back lip are the parts that we need. I hit that button, it lights up green. If we're doing the flat fence, we need those parts instead. Lights up red. So now there's much less chance of making a mistake because I have strong visual controls in a very complicated station. My favorite improvement this year is right here where I work on my molds. I got all my bits and stuff here, but we put the fast pipe tool holder on this little slide so I can keep all my drills and stuff. It frees up table space for when you're working on molds, there can be tons of stuff out. And so we need to use all the space that we can. This saves a whole lot of space. My favorite improvement is the GPS tape that we applied to our robot. So we have a lot of different moving parts and a lot of air lines that are going around, control different parts of it. We have a legend here and on all the wires, they're all taped at the starting point and the ending point correlating to what they control and up where the solenoids are and switches, everything is labeled. It's really easy. Anytime there's an issue we need to diagnose or try and fix it, cuts our time by at least half. My favorite improvement is the spray painting table. For people were spray painting on the downdraft table for sanding. We want them using the spray paint table. Everything has a home from a can to the trash can to all of our extra cans. Magnets hold metal irregular metal pieces down so they don't move on us and it's mobile so you can take it to wherever you need it my favorite improvement of 2019 is this flex bench cart that we made so when we're machining out the pieces for the flex bench there's a ton of pieces we would put them on tables on rolling carts everywhere we didn't know where to put them which piece it was so we made this dedicated cart you can see each one of these little slots is labeled for each one of the different parts of the flex bench so as we're machining them, we put them in there. We know exactly what we need, what we have, what we don't have. We have spots up here to hold the long tray supports, spot over here for shelf supports. The small pieces go in these bins. And once we fill up this whole cart, we know that's one whole flex bed. My favorite improvement is I'm here at the three-way clamp. Um, when I was in Japan, I saw how the water spider was feeding stuff to the person working so that they didn't have to waste any motion. So, we have our three-way clamps. I run out of a box. You, I used to have to go pull one, but now all I have to do when I have an empty box is slide this over. It's right there. I cut it open, and then I can put my three-way clamp right here, and I'm done, and I have a box ready to go. So when the office bring a fast pipe order, they put it here in the clipboard, and whenever I'm in the facility, I can see the light and come work in the order. Need another improvement? Yes, so when we get an order for connectors, we assemble it for the customer like this, and we put it in the bag. But now, we have it visual, and we don't have to assemble it anymore. We put it in the bag, and the customer have all the instructions they need to put it together. Saving you the time of putting them all together, yes. and the customer knows clearly how to put them yes. all together. All on the bag. Hey, my favorite improvement of the year has got to be this pneumatic magnet dispenser that Lucas made. And so before, we had one like this where you have to manually just pull it every time. It's slow, it's a lot of movement. And the magnets are inserted. And the magnets are inserted. Now, we have this pneumatic device, which down here, we have our pedal with our Pokioka sign on it. And what's the Pokioka sign do? It makes us remember that we have something down there. So, so nothing gets run it. over it. So nothing can yeah. run over it. So it's it. in with the Kanban. So when you put the Kanban back with the finished product, it, the Pokioke says, hey, don't forget the foot pedal. Yeah, and put it back. Well, that's a great improvement right there. The mag strips here and this nice little holder that attaches under the table. Look at that. Look how clever that is. Okay, Holds so that right just plugs out. in. So Those it's a quick holes. change build station. So as you need to build it, you go. And then we load it up. All our mag strips. When we're ready to go, just place it in here pedal and it magnetizes right to the front and keep going keep building them keep so building them when we keep building them so this tells you how many you have to build to the red and look how fast this is eliminate a bunch of motion right wow and look at this it's all stacking up right here very cool there's six right there. not bad lucas thanks <laughs> <laughs> my favorite improvement is this 
clip, magnetic clip I made to clip my order onto my pallet jack. Go over here, and I can clip it to the racking. Got the information I need. I can pick what I gotta pick. Do my highlights onto the next order. Over here. Got the information I need. And then onto the next order. My favorite improvement of 2019 is this rack where we could store extra pallets here so it clears up the floor space. And we do about 10 to 30 shipments a day. And we've done 900 shipments in three months. Wow, that's incredible. My favorite improvement of 2019 is the hedge trimmer. I used to have to struggle and break my back and my arms were dying. Now it's an hour and I'm done. I have one more favorite improvement and it's making it easier for everyone else. So we have all our combines, they're all color coded. They tell where each thing is going like injection molding so they don't have to walk way over there. We also made this put away water spider combine that when they have a product that needs to be put away, it's attached to their combine when they're done with it, they put it here and then the water spider knows to put it away so they're not wasting their time. Also on the back of our water spider cards, the ones that we're putting pallets away, it tells us which orientation, how it goes and a picture of it. So it makes it super easy to know how to do it. My favorite improvement was learning about lean and realizing how messy my car was and how messy my room was. So I brought home the principles of lean to my house and it's been working awesome and it's a good thing to get into. My favorite improvement is this roller system that we added to our shipping table. We, uh, they, we used to struggle a lot because it would smack in and not go anywhere. So we added those little rollers. So when I'm done shipping my box, I can just give it a push and it'll hit it and it'll just roll on down the belt. Bye bye. And the big one, push the little ones. My favorite improvement is Jordan in the office emails me orders and it saves me from walking all the way to the office and back every time. Right. My favorite improvement is at the mag station. So before everything was strewn down, you had to pull everything together. Now it's on a roller. Everything is right where you need it. Super easy and simple. Hey guys, my favorite improvement of 2019 is the inventory order board. There is multiple computers throughout the facility that you can write down your part that you need. And you can, it used to be a clipboard over here and now it has saved a lot of time from people having to walk from shipping over to production to write that down. Now it's all done on a Google document. My favorite improvement this year has been adding a packing station to the mail terminal. So before we used to pack everything at the regular shipping table and then have to fill it in and bring it all the way over here to ship it. Now we have the mail separated out. We pack it here, we ship it here, we put it in the bin and it's ready to go. My favorite improvement is our new drawer for bags. We have all our size bags, rubber bands, and it used to be down at the end of the table. So now we don't have to walk to down there. Right here. All right, my favorite improvement is at the hole punch station here. So at the hole punch station, we build three different SKUs, single, the punch kit, and the pro kit. And so there's three different con bonds that can get pulled that require to use this station. So often there will be multiple of them pulled at the same time. And from this station to the con bond board, well, it's quite a way. Let me show you. You got to go all the way down here, around the corner, all the way down the combine board. So when I walk up to the Kanban board, it might have a Kanban here that says hole punch kit. And so I'll grab the Kanban, says hole punch kit, and I'll go run that whole way to find out that someone's already using the station. I gotta come all the way back here, put the Kanban back on the board and wait. But you don't because there's a sign down there. So now I Let's put a go. sign up here. There's this big light up box. I can see it from the board right here. that says hole punch station full. And that goes on and off when you open the station. It's this U-shaped cell station here. And when I fold this down to use it, that light turns on. When I'm done and I fold it up, boom, the light's off. Lights off. Guess what? You can build. So now I know from the Kanban board whether I can build that or not. No wasted time. Right, Miller? Touch. Even Miller loves yeah, it. Miller likes it. Here he is, Johnny. Why? Because he helps a lot. Max was so busy this year. Doing all these pallet and container loads. Yes. He had to have some help and we got a great guy to do it. All right. I love fast cap. <laughs> okay, so my favorite improvement was this jig that will sort your waste 
and your actual product when you're cutting custom caps. So all the waste is just falling down there and the real product is coming out right here. That is very cool, Maylin, very clever. And then you did all this with magnets. So this board just goes on there with magnet. That little slit goes there. So that's easy for you to set up and away you go. That is fantastic. Alrighty, so this is our Kanban cards. This is, is here in the graphic section where we print all of our labels. So when we come up to our printing station, we used to have to type in. So here's our Kanban for this. So I type out Kanban. Oh, well look at that. There's a several jobs that have Kanban in it. So we decided to do a barcode to make it so much easier that you didn't have to search and there it is. That's the job that I have to print. We went a little bit further so you didn't have to write in all these little labels or information. We made a printed version so we just have to type it in and print it and it's ready to go. Favorite improvement for 2020? Killer, Jamie. Okay. So my favorite improvement this year has a lot to do with our new employees. We will take a new photo and then we Photoshop and cut them out. But we used to have to resize every photo because every photo was a different size. So now we have created this template so everyone's face always fits within the circle. So then when we come over to our InDesign, we used to also have all these different files, all separate things, right? Now it's all in one. So my photo sized, I can now relink all of my pictures. I'm gonna do Johnny. So his photo will automatically fit perfectly on all of these oh things. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. And then I'm gonna do command find John because that was the name that was in there. And now I'm gonna put Johnny's name in here and change all of them. So it does them all simultaneously, and then all I have to do from there is hit print. Oh my done. god, that is smoking. <laughs> my favorite improvement of the year is this whole station. We set up an Amazon printer, so now Leanne doesn't have to be the only one to do them. And we set up this scale, so we don't have to go all the way out to shipping to weigh everything whenever we want to ship. Oh cool, so this saves a lot of time and motion. Oh, oh yeah, tons of it. Well, awesome. My favorite improvement this year is in custom color, we will have to wait for material. So I have a folder full of orders. But if they're FedEx, they have to go on a clipboard. Or if they're next to air, they all have clipboards. But we used to have clipboards sticking out of here. They wouldn't all fit, they'd bunch up. And shipping would wonder, do I have a clipboard that has to go today? So instead of using all the clipboards, I made FedEx, next to air, second to air, all the different things, and I clipped them on the orders so they can go in the folder until I get the material, and then I pull them out Put a clipboard on, order done. Super clean. Yep. My favorite improvement from 2019 is our container tracking list. So it has all of our container numbers, all of the ETAs, and the packing list is hyperlinked. So you can go right to it and it opens up the packing list and you can check it off when it's received so we know what containers are coming and which ones have already been here. Wow, very cool. The improvement of 2019 is, I used to write sticky notes every morning for Amazons and stick them all over those people and it was too messy and too hard. So I made things you can wipe off that you just write what they need for them to build and then they make them wipe them off and give them back to me. Oh, that's cool. One of my favorite improvements for 2019 was look at this bitchin' cart. This is my electric cart with all my tools and everything in it. Drink holder, magnetic mount for my phone. I just stick it on like that. Make it till Boom. 2020. No, 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 give me that crap. <laughs> This year is my scooter and all my toolbox, but to be honest with you, that's not it. My favorite improvement has to do with David right here, and that is the fast cap experience. For the last 15 years, we had people come from all over the world to learn about how we do what we do here, two second lean, and they spend a week here. But we didn't really tell people we were doing it formally, so we told people in 2019, if you really want to move to the next level and stop all the nonsense, Come and do the Fast Cap Experience. David just finished one week here with the Fast Cap Experience. What'd you learn? I learned a lot about standardization and communication. Just how to how to get everything down pat so everyone knows exactly what to do. So there's no confusion? No confusion. Everything clear, concise, perfect. And you're gonna do things differently when you go back now? Absolutely. And if you would yeah. not have come here, do you think that would have been? Never in a million never years. Never in a million years. Never in a million years. So the week was worth it? Absolutely. And how much did we charge you? Uh, Zero. Zero! You want to move to the next level? Fast cap experience.